Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or if you are new, welcome. Today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a haul for you guys and showing everything that I got for Levi to take to daycare. Levi is starting daycare just one day a week. He starts next month, so October. They haven't confirmed the exact date yet, but we should know in the next week or so when exactly he's starting. They just need to confirm a spot for him. I'm hoping it's before we move because that will work out great for us. That means we can get a lot more done while he's not home. I did talk a little bit about why he is starting daycare in my life update, so I'll link that video below for you so you can go and check it out. The daycare that we ended up going with actually provides quite a lot for him, so they provide all the food and all the nappies. We just need to send him with some spare clothes and some sheets and also his bottles and formula. The first thing I have to show you guys are these labels that I got from Big W. I got them on sale for $14. They had a big clearance online, so I figured I would order some and give them a shot. I got a pack of mini labels and a pack of iron-on labels. So far the quality of them is great. I haven't obviously had a chance to wash them a few times yet, but we will see how they hold up. They are doing well though, and I figured for $14, I would just take the chance and grab them anyway. The next thing I grabbed was a two pack of Jersey cotton sheets from Kmart. These ones I got for $9, and I figured I could just get an extra couple of sets to leave at daycare, and then we can keep our home ones at home. I also grabbed a formula dispenser from Woolworths. This one I got for $2.25. We actually have this one at home, and it works really well with the formula that we use, but I wanted to have a separate one that to send to daycare just in case it gets left behind that way we've still got one at home the next thing that I grabbed was this lunch bag from Kmart it was seven dollars and I just wanted something to store all of his bottles in when we send them to school um, so I figured I'd pick this one up I saw it and it looked like the perfect size so I grabbed it so I ordered this school bag from stuck on you it's just the mini backpack and it is super cute and I'm so excited about it we spent $29 on it um, and when it arrived, it was super, super tiny. I didn't think it was going to be that small. That's my fault though, because I obviously didn't read the measurements on the listing, but that's okay. It's really cute anyway, and it'll fit his clothes in there and his hats and stuff. It's just that, yeah, we did have to buy an extra bag to put his bottles in. So at home, Levi sleeps with a jelly cat bunny. He also carries it around with him during the day sometimes. He absolutely loves his bunny and I knew that we would need to send it to daycare with him. My main concern was that I didn't want it to get lost or left behind or have someone end up taking it home accidentally. So what I did was I bought a second jelly cat bunny and I had his name embroidered on it. So the jelly cat bunny was $24 and then I paid a lady locally $20 and she embroidered on it for me. The last thing that I picked up was a bee box sippy cup. We hadn't actually used one of these before and I've actually been going through all the different kinds of sippy cups you can buy. We had a straw sippy cup that was a newbie one, we had a tummy tippy one, and then we had one of the tummy tippy infinity cups. Levi sort of struggled with the concept of tipping the sippy cup up to get the water out. He's not quite big enough to do that yet. So I decided to try the bee box one because I saw one of his friends drinking out of it and I thought maybe we'll give it a crack and see if it works. Straight away gave it to him and he managed to drink out of it and now he carries it around on the floor with him and drinks whenever he wants water. So yeah, super amazing. We ended up buying a second one. This one is going to be sent to daycare with him so that he can have water throughout the day there as well. I picked it up from Big W for $14 and we also picked up a straw cleaning set for $9 as well. So that's all we have got for now. I'm sure we'll probably come across a few extra things that we need along the way, especially as he gets bigger. But for now, that's all we got for him and I think that that will do us for the meantime. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please let me know in the comments below if there's anything else you'd like to see and don't forget to like and subscribe.